605 right now. Police are asking for the public's help to try and solve the murder of a man in Northeast Baltimore that happened nearly two years ago. Cornelius Bruce was found inside of a burning vehicle back in January 2020. Investigators are offering a $5,000 reward for information that leads to an arrest. We have W. Mayor News' Mark Roper live at police headquarters right now in downtown Baltimore. And Mark, there is new information about this case. Yeah, good morning, Christian. ATF or Alcohol, Tobacco and Firearms, along with the Baltimore Police Department, have new surveillance video that they're hoping that someone will be able to take a look at, which could help solve this case for Cornelius Bruce's family. Now, these are the images of a man that investigators are calling a person of interest, wanted in connection with the death of 27-year-old Cornelius Bruce. Cornelius was found inside a burning vehicle behind Lake Clifton High School on St. Lowe Drive on January 20th, 2020. Investigators say he was shot and killed before someone put him in the car, which was then set on fire. A man with a gray hood dressed all in black was caught on surveillance video at the BP gas station on Bel Air Road prior to the car fire. And in the video, you can see he has a red gas can in his hand. Investigators believe he walked up to the gas station around 830 the night of January 20th, 2020, filled up the gas can and walked off. An hour later, Cornelius's body was found in a burning car. Cornelius's sister, Caprice, shared her pain of seeing the surveillance video of the person of interest in her brother's death for the first time Tuesday night. My little brother worked every day. He came to my house every day. He was like my best friend. He is my best friend. Me and my brothers and my sisters, we were real close. We was raised as we all we got. And that's how it's always been. When my little brother was died, they was disrespected. And if you have any information about the man seen in that surveillance video, if you have a tip that you can call the ATF, you can possibly claim a reward if that leads to an arrest. Just call 888-ATF-TIPS. Reporting live in downtown Baltimore outside police headquarters, Mark Roper, WMER2 News.